everyone, it's Jennifer with DP Addiction Adventures, and um, it has been quite an interesting weekend to say the least. Um, it is Sunday, September 30th, um, and well, all weekend I was watching my brother and sister-in-law's children so they could go and enjoy some timing in, um, in Stratford, Canada for their 20th anniversary. So I had my daughter who will be 11 in 23 days. I have my nephew who will be 13, my other nephew who's six, and my niece who is three. So from the ages of three to 13, when I agreed to it, I didn't realize until a little bit later that my husband was gonna be gone for a men's retreat. So it was the four of us, or the four of them and me, and then a dog who um, needs to learn how to be around children. And so it was quite an interesting weekend. Um, I did introduce my 13-year-old nephew with one of those poster LOL um, little freebies, and he loved it and finished it while he was here. Um, so yeah, he's like, I, I now can see why you like it so much. And I was like, yep, great, love it. Um, so yeah, that's kind of where I'm at. Um, so cue the music, cue the excitement. Tomorrow is October 1st. And what does that mean? That means Diamond Paint Along collaboration. I'm so excited. Um, I actually, I wasn't going to do this, but I will, was trying to get this done. Do, do, do before we had to switch over because we can't use work in progress and I didn't quite finish it. I've got about a third left of it. Um, so this is going to go on the shelf for a little while. I don't have the details of what it is. I do know it's a 40. There's my yarn. Whew. Now you know it's my video. Um, I do know it's a 40 by 50. But yeah, so that's getting put away. I'll probably work on it just a little bit more tonight while this video is uploading. But I want to get this uploaded so you guys can see it before the paint along. Um, I do have a couple more videos I'm planning on. Number one, I'm going to try to fit in this week a tutorial on how to make these duct tape um, roses. I know there's a couple other videos out there, but um, I hope to simplify it. Now this is just one of my Sharpie pens, but somebody came up with a great idea. And forgive me, I, I, she's in my comments. Um, and I don't know why I didn't think about it, but doing it to a diamond pen. So I figured before I did that, I would just use it as a tutorial and how I would create one of these for our diamond pens considering that a lot of us have duct tape hang hanging around. So I hope to do that in the next couple days. So definitely keep, you know, if you want to see it, subscribe, ring the little bell. It'll alert you when my next video is up. Um, I also hope to do a um, video on an upcoming one of my um, paint-alongs. It's the girl with the little um, elephant. So I haven't done any of the setup yet. All my drills are here and I did an unboxing on that. I'll put the little eye right up here if you want to see the unboxing. Um, but yeah, I thought I would do a how I kit things up and how I use um, storage for that. I have the one I'm starting for the paint along already put together and kitted up. So, but I did register, I think a total of five or six. I'm pretty ambitious um, to see, see if I can get five or six done on this paint along. So, in honor of the upcoming Drillathon, um, that's kind of what I'm calling it, I have been saving and saving and saving. So as you know, my budget, with my husband, my agreement is $30 per month. Um, in August, I stayed pretty close to it. Um, towards the end of the month, 
there was the um, the sale I went over by maybe $10 um, this month except for the what we're gonna unbox now I stayed true to it I think I spent $25 and I'm not planning on getting anything in October at all because I want to save up for the November 11th AliExpress so that I can give myself a full $60. Having said that, this painting, ever since Brandy from Abstract Crafter showed this to me through her video, I have been drooling over it. And I went to purchase it they only had it in round. I'm addicted to square. Um, I will do round, but I'm not, you know, I'm not on the round team. I do enjoy it. Um, and I do it to give myself a break, but it doesn't necessarily float my boat and tickle me pink. So um, when I went to purchase this, I they didn't have it. Um, it also, they were switching inventory out, which I want to tell you... Um, that if you received a kit from this company, I'll just give you the name, Diamond Art Club. If you received a kit from this company and it wasn't what you thought, they have amazing customer service. Give them another chance. I know they were switching out old inventory, um, trying to clearance it out. Um, please give them a chance. They're amazing women. They're in it to really help us enjoy the... Um, the experience they're not paying any of us I'm not an affiliate um, I just was really this will probably I, I probably won't own many of them because I can't afford them but they are worth it so if I do see one like this one I will save up my budget now because I had already spent my budget and because I wanted this in part of the three month drillathon I'm not gonna do it till maybe um, end of November, early December, because I have a couple other ones I'm doing first. Um, because the drill-a-thon or the drill with me or drill along, you don't need to be part of Diamond Art Club. We're not trying to sell their brand. It's just they were amazing sponsors to offer the, the awards, um, the prizes. But that being said, I really, really wanted this. And so my husband said, go ahead and get it. Isn't he a sweetheart? Yeah. So, um, without further ado, this, like I said, is Diamond Art Club. I ordered it on September 26th um, at like 12 o'clock in the morning. Um, they shipped it later that day. It was delivered on the 28th, so it took two days to get here. Um, it's called Tell Me Stories, so you may, if you're part of Abstract Crafters um, Posse, you may have seen it. Um, it is a 52 by 61. It is square. Um, it did cost $52.95, but I um, had a discount. So after shipping, it was $43.06. So yeah, this is definitely out of my price range, but I'm hoping it's totally worth it. Um, they send it to box, so they have their own packing tape that says Diamond Art Club, do what makes you sparkle. So I'm really excited, guys. And I've been waiting probably three, three months for this to get back in stock. So as you can see, it's, they ship it in a box on its own. They give you a shipping receipt. They give you a little thank you. Um, they give you a code that you can use at the bottom. The thank you says, for being a valuable member of the Diamond Club family, um, they hope you have a pleasant experience. Um, please share your masterpiece on Facebook and other social media. And then they give you 15% off your order. And then they have a little like how to on the back. So that's pretty cool for people just starting out. All right. So this is their new packaging. So if you get one of the white boxes, you probably have bought their old stock, which some of the old stock is phenomenal and some of it, um, 
they were still testing some things out. And that's why it's a lower cost, guys. Like, that's why they're clearancing it. They're trying to figure it out. Um, some of the stuff was a little too small for the paintings. What I like about Diamond Art Club is they pay their artists. Um, so this is the Tell Me Stories. So it's like a goldfish. And then there's so much detail in here. There's like a, a butterfly and a heart and little bubbles coming out of the mouth of the fish. And then there's um, a little clock and a piano, piano keys. So I'm just really excited. Also, they have how it works. So they have nine different steps. They're all pictorial. And then underneath, um, they, they say in English what to do. Um, they also have what contents are in here. So you get a canvas, rhinestones, an applicator, a wax pad, and a craft tray. All right, so let's get in here and see what's going on. Again, this is my first Diamond Art Club, and you guys that have been part of my family know that I have a lot of diamond paintings, so this is not, this is me just trying it out. We all have to get on the bandwagon at some point, right? Okay, so the canvas is in a plastic bag. Again, it has their little saying on it. Do what makes you sparkle. Oh, and just like everybody else talks about, this is like velvet. The feel of it, it's, it feels very similar to my micro suede upstairs. I have a micro suede. Um, all right. It's got 42 colors. Again, another step by step. How to do it. Not sure why it's double sided because it's the same thing on each side, but hey. Now, from what I've read, from what they tell me, um, you're supposed to just leave this out and let the canvas do its thing. All right. So, first, let's look at the symbols. All right. So the symbols are very like similar. It's like a mix between Hua Can's tight, well, you know, they're cross stitching symbols. So um, looks like they're all pretty unique, which is nice. So yeah, already it's doing its thing. Um, down here, there's a lifetime warranty. It says, if you lose a diamond on your artwork or your artwork is damaged, it comes with a lifetime warranty from Diamond Art Club. That's amazing. So after you put it up on the wall or if you're done with it and you something falls off in a couple years, um, you can contact them. Um, they also have a visit us on Facebook and Instagram check out our selections. Um, what I like too is they have like this little treatment where they have punched holes so you can see it on both sides to keep it from fraying. So that's really nice. Um, they also have the key on both sides depending on which side you're working on. They also have the model number up here in the top right. So there's the model number, the name, and the size. Now, this says a 60 by 79. That's the canvas, um, I believe. Let, let's measure. Yeah, 
so this is 51 and a half, um, just over 51 and a half. Which it says it was 52. And this way. It's it's 70. And it said it was 61. So that's kind of interesting. So the sizing is actually. Let me try that again. Make sure I was reading that right. Yeah, it's almost 70. So this size actually is more true. It's 50, it's roughly, it's just under 52. So it's like 51 and 3 fourths by 70 um, instead of the 52 by 61. So. Also, another thing is there's like a sparkle to this, um, if you can see it, on the canvas. Now, when I was reading on their site and watching some of the videos, it's a treatment that helps. I, I'm sorry I forgot what it helps, but it helps like, I don't know if it's the color quality. I don't know if it's keeping the fray. I'm not quite sure, but it's specifically, it's actually a treatment they put on the canvas um, to help it. Um, let's see here. This says Diamond Art Club. It's the number, tell me stories. Now it says when it was, um, I don't know if it, this was packaged or when it was actually made, but it says 8-9-2018. So very recent. Now, they do not tell you how many you need. They don't have an inventory sheet. You just gotta trust the process, as Ella says. Now that's, the only downfall I don't like is that um, you just have to trust. I wish, like even like who can does where it says up here on the key, but it doesn't. This only has the DMC numbers. So that's like the only downfall. Um, I haven't heard anybody have any issues with missing pieces. Also, they are American-based, so if you live in America, I mean, they're going to they're gonna send it within a couple days, um, as far as that's concerned. Um, also, one thing to notice is it is a, a more sturdy plastic. Um, it has more edges around it, so that's nice. Um, it also has the metallic color, which I really like. Okay. Um, so yeah, I'm going to make sure, I don't know how to do this, how to inventory it really. I guess, um, just put it in different categories. As far as that's concerned, so here's all the 300s, here's all the 900s, 600s. So, yeah, I would like to know from you guys if number one, are you do you know about the diamond paint along? Um, number one, it doesn't have to be Diamond Art Club, it is fantastic for everybody. I'm so excited. Um, number two, are you partaking in it? Um, and if so, what are you doing for your art club? I would like to know. Um, not art club, I'm sorry. See, this is why I can't do more than one thing at a time. Um, what are you doing for the paint along? Um, I have a couple. I'm doing one, at least one in each category. So that's exciting. Um, I'm also doing my first chalkboard. And some people have asked, what is a chalkboard painting? It's nothing special. It's not a special type of diamond painting. It literally is those, it looks like somebody had done a design on a chalkboard. It's just 
the the picture itself. I mean, they're all over AliExpress. Um, so if you just go on, you'll see many, many, many of them. So I'm doing my first one of those. The reason I point that out is it's it doesn't actually have a huge amount, more than I thought of three tens because it's a gray it's a gray background so to speak look at all these colors guys aren't these beautiful terrific um i'm not quite sure how they inventory this when they're packing it with it being this um sporadic in the bag i mean yeah, I did pour the bag out, as you can see, but I literally poured it out. So what you see is how it was also in the bag. So I'm wondering, how in the world do they make sure everything is in here? Because the colors aren't even together together. It's one thing to be out of order, but usually you've got... One thing, too, I've noticed they're all separate. So they're not, like this is 820 and 820, but they're not together. They're separated. So they've all been cut apart, which has its pros and its cons, right? Nope. 800. Um, oh, I'm going to love this, guys. I'm so excited. I'm so happy. I keep putting the 800 in the 600s, right? What's up with that? Um, 7777, seven, seven, seven. where's my sevens? Right here in front of me. Yeah, so I'm doing the girl with the elephant for the paint along. Um, I'm also doing my Be Still chalkboard. I'm also doing, um, my what do you want to call it I'm trying to think here oh, I have several that I've entered it's crazy how many I entered I think excuse me I think I'm being really ambitious but when I talked to Gwenny from everybody everything uh, everything Gwenny people want to say everybody loves Gwenny I love you Gwenny so when I talked to her, um, I was like, do I just register one at a time, you know, as I'm completing them? Or do you want me to register all the ones you think I'm going to do right now? And she, I think there's going to be some sort of tracking. So she said, go ahead and do them right now um, so that you can have the tracking available. So we shall see. Okay, so this one. Now we all know that like this red color is 606, but it could be 909. So there's two things. Number one, we can use the trick that we've all been taught that this um, gets fed through the machine on the left. So then we know that the numbers are correct, but also because Diamond Art Club has a little number on the bottom, if you can see that, to the right of the six um, on every single one of them like this oh, this is not a good one to look at because of my lighting so this is 797 and you can see like that little over here this little thing right here it says a five so every single one of these has a number similar to that um so you can tell which way is which as far as that's concerned. Um, so yeah, that's how we go, that's how we go. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and fast forward through the rest of this so that you don't have to painfully watch me organize.
Okay, my friends. All the colors are here. Like I said, they don't have an inventory sheet. And they don't tell you how many bags you should have. But I've never heard that we've run out of them. Also, they have the lifetime warranty and they're in the United States. So I'm in the United States. So if I needed it, I know I'd get it like within two days or so. So I am not worried at all about that. Um, the last thing to go over is this little diamond painting toolkit. Um, I've heard great things and seen great things. So they have a blue pen with a grippy, which is really nice. I've been looking forward to this clear tray. They gave us some baggies with this clear tray. And then this cute little heart of wax. You can see that. So that's adorable. Um, the nice thing about this, it um, says tool kit contents, your applicator, comfort grip, wax pad, and craft tray. So that's awesome. They've done a really great job. I also like this bag, so by the time I get it, it's not poking through. My stuff always pokes through the bottom. So that's very nice. So yeah, let's go through, and as you can see, my canvas is already almost flat as far as that's concerned. So let's do our stars. So canvas quality, which is feel, size, glue, symbols, and more. Um, it is a clear coat. It's very sticky. The symbols are extremely clear. Um, let me show you. I know I showed you on the key. Let me show you these symbols so that you know I'm not, not lying. How clear they are. Trying to find a spot that's not super dark because they are clear. My lighting's just bad, but yeah. So I give it a full star. Um, drills, quantity, packaging, number readable. Um, if I don't have enough, I'll come back in the description. I know it's going to be a couple months and change this or or change um, put an ending to this. But right now I'm gonna say a full star. I mean, the packaging, they were all here. It's got the sturdy plastic, it's got the metallic so you can read them. Um, shipping, oh my gosh. They sent me an email when it was ordered, they sent me an email when it was shipped, and they sent me an email when it had arrived. Um, it didn't have a foam roller, but it was wrapped in plastic, in a box, in a box. So, and the first box was plastic wrapped, and um, it also shipped two day. So, shipping, I give it a full star. Advertising of the product, did I get what I wanted? Um, it is larger, but I'm not gonna fault them for that. I'd rather have larger than smaller. So I'm gonna give them a full, full star. An overall impression, would I buy again? Absolutely. So I cannot wait to complete it. Um, so yeah, and the colors of the drills are phenomenally, like, dead on as far as vibrant and solid. I didn't see any oil problems, any squishy drills. Excuse me. But I will keep you posted on that in the post review. So thank you so much for hanging in there. I know it's a little bit longer of an unboxing, but we had some stuff at the beginning to talk about. And I cannot wait to get this uploaded and my next video, hopefully we will be knee deep and drilling together. So take care. Love you all. Until next time, be blessed.